it's Luca, welcome back to my channel. And I'm honestly so excited to do this video because I've had it in a little back burner of my mind. Not even a saying I don't really know, but it is Valentine's Day and I am in the mood to treat myself. I do not have anyone I'm spending Valentine's Day with today. And I thought, what a better day than to take myself out on a date. And I've been wanting to do this for so long. Honestly, I think self-love is one of the most important things to learn in this lifetime because at the end of the day people are gonna come in and out of your life you're gonna have relationships they're gonna teach you different things and I want to reference my intentionally single video that I made last year and if you guys are struggling with feeling lonely on Valentine's Day then I just encourage you to maybe watch that video and change your mindset around being single because in my opinion I think it's a great time to learn more about yourself and just grow into the person that you're meant to be so if you are new to my channel make sure you subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you like the concept and if you are in favor of self-love and loving yourself first as well I'm in my workout clothes because I just got back from the gym and I need to shower but that's part of the getting ready for my whole date process I need to get myself looking cute and shower and not sweaty I want to show you guys what my parents got me for Valentine's Day it's this super pretty heart and this is a crystal actually and it is like love the love crystal I don't I forget what it's called um but it had like a whole explanation behind it and I was, I was so sweet I've never had the mindset really that you need someone else to be happy on Valentine's Day I don't know you don't need anyone you can just soak up the love in the air because guess what everyone's vibrating that love frequency you don't need to be in a relationship to feel that you just soak it up you just soak all that love up that everyone else is giving and you can just have it all in your own energy you know if you guys are feeling lonely I just want to say it's gonna be okay it really is and there's plenty of fish in the sea and just because you don't have a fish in your sea <laughs> Okay, what? Do that sentence over. Just because you don't have a boo, a pet. I'm sorry if you don't. If you don't have a dog, like that's where I'm truly sorry. I'm very sorry for you if you do not have a dog. Um, bless your heart. Sending love. Anyway, you just need to be patient because someone is out there, and just because you don't have someone right now doesn't mean you're gonna be lonely forever. But whatever you do, do not stay in that desperate mindset because that is not what's going to attract love for you. It's not. You have to feel it first within yourself and for yourself because how are you going to expect anyone else to love you if you can't even love yourself first? Desperate energy will attract people who are also dressed desperate, and that means not be the best relationship so you need to just take your time just do your thing girl or guy so I am going to do my everyday makeup look but I'm going to kind of do a little bit extra because it's Valentine's Day so if you guys would like to see like my everyday makeup routine I actually just posted a video showing you that so go and check that out but what I think what I have planned for myself so far today is I'm going to get myself some mod Matcha because I love matcha. I had coffee yesterday and I kind of got anxiety from it so I would not like anxiety today so we are not getting coffee. I'm probably gonna take myself to the Green Zebra Cafe which is like a little healthy restaurant and I'm probably gonna get an acai bowl honestly. Feels like the mood today. I need to think of more things that I need to do with myself. Um, that's what we got so far. Feel it baby, stress is all around us, these high ceilings and I need a baby. Pressure it, make diamonds, I won't steal it baby. Silent Baby, I'm hangry right now. I'm so hangry. Sis needs some lunch. My outfit is like killer. Like I'm I can't believe I went off and did this. So I have my shirt from Princess Polly, which I low-key broke trying to put on, but it looks okay. It looks like it's in pieces. So let's hope it doesn't like, you know, fall off of me today. I doubt that will happen, but literally like I heard a snapping sound. So you know that's a thing, but we don't talk about it. And then we can't forget about the necklace looks so cute and dainty. Oh my gosh. Focus. And then my pants are from Urban. These are literally the coolest freaking like, oops, sorry. I can't say the F word anymore because my mom doesn't like it. So these are so nice exclamation point and then <laughs> my belt is from brandy my shoes are from balenciaga and they go well with this fit <laughs> I'm just casually trying to bump with the couple next to me i'm like 
<laughs> They're like, nah. I'm listening to my, literally one of my favorite songs because it reminds me of myself and just me. Literally the most sensitive person ever. And you know what? It's fine. I love that about myself. <laughs> In a way, kind of sometimes. Sensitivity by Warm Tin. Just whenever I listen to it, I feel like so much happiness. Um, I'm sitting at this light, it's pretty long, so I'm probably gonna ramble more, yay! I hit legs so hard today, y'all don't even know. I really was out here pushing my limits, and if I don't find a Valentine at the Green Zebra, I'm screaming! I gotta get in the sleigh, yeah, yeah, and let me over, let me over. Anyway, I'm actually so excited because my friend Alex and I are gonna get Froyo tonight, so I have some Galentine plans. Guys, I was kind of worried that um, today was gonna be a nasty day because it, I woke up and it was so rainy, but now it's so hot. Like, the sun is blasting. Look how good it looks. Oh my gosh. Ah, meal. Let's try this. I know you trying, ain't no lying, baby. When I say I need you, greedy. It's very good. I'm gonna feel very uncomfortable vlogging, so I'm going to go. Hi guys. <laughs> ah, it's a little dark, Cleo. I don't know what's happening. So I wanted to talk about something that I am really passionate about. Whenever holidays come around, I think it's so important to focus on giving back to people who are in need. But I found this one of you guys actually um, gave this foundation to me, and it's called the Valentine's Day Project or the Valentine Project. And it was started 10 years ago by a family in Alliance, Ohio. And their son came up with the idea to start sending care packages on Valentine's Day. So it's kind of like Santa, but for Valentine's Day. So the kids that are on the list for the gifts are affected with pediatric cancer and chronic illness. Their goal is just to spread kindness and love. Um, I'm gonna link their website down below if you guys want to donate. They accept donations past Valentine's Day. So if you guys want to help kids that have chronic illnesses and I just think it would, it's it feels so good to give back and we can be wrapped up in all of our own situations sometimes that we forget that there are people out there that really need the love and really need the support so I would encourage you guys to do that I am about to go to get some matcha which is my favorite oh my gosh I spend way too much money on food and drinks but whatever whatever it's fine I'm a hungry girl and I need my caffeine so plus I'm on a date with myself And there's a super cute bike with flowers in it. I just thought it was so cute. Target and the musical instrument is always always good for that and I just earned I earned I'm already crashing for my caffeine and I literally just danced so hard because I had such a rush but anyway I'm getting off topic here I learned self-control by Frank Ocean I'm getting there so I'll play you guys a little bit I 
just hit my funny bone. I don't even know what happened. Make sure to check out the Valentine project. I will link it down below. And make sure you tell someone you love them, even if it's just like your family members. And subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. I got so much back, I think I'm never running out. Yeah, bust me down a little bitch. I don't do this for no clout. Hey, I got so much back, I think.